So the other day, I broke this. It just looks like an antler, but that is a really important tool for me in my flint napping. I hold this between my knees and whack it with this big baton to do indirect work while I busted it plumbing too. So it's that. So I gotta build a new one. So I'll build a new one. This is the new one. Patent pending, by the way. I kind of come up with this by myself, my own little design. Just took a power drill and bored this out, and I bored a hole out in the end of it. And the idea is, if I blow this bit up, doing my my indirect, hit a piece of hard chert, say it just blows up because the rock's too hard or this is too soft, whatever. So just gonna unglue it, unwrap my sinew. That comes out. And I can interchange these other ones. Something like that. Of course, I have to trim them and stuff. But, and then just re glue it. Right? Blow that one up. Put another one in. Or if I need a different size tool or whatever, blow it up. Put another one in. Y'all get the idea. But they ain't just gonna sit in there like that. They're all gonna be really heavily glued with pine pitch glue. And I'm gonna have to wrap them really, really extra good with sinew too, but that's about it. It's just a piece of ironwood, which is a really tough native species of wood we have here in Eastern Kentucky. It's almost like a small beech tree. Uh, a lot of people call them a buckhorn. This is a really hard, really hard type of wood. The grain in it's not straight, and it makes it really tough. Really hard, like you try to split that with a maw, it'll just spring back and hit you. But I pretty much got it made. This is one I'm gonna put in there, but I'll get that thing glued in. And then the fun part, testing this bad boy. Well, it held up. Just a little bit of wear on the antler tip from flaking, but all the fastening there is held right where it should have. Nothing's loose. It just wore my tine down a little bit. I really kind of abused this thing too. I didn't take it easy. I was rearing back and hitting that thing as hard as I could with one hand. See there where I slapped the bark off of it, but that ain't gonna count for nothing. It's superficial damage. This here is the main thing. Held fast, still tight, solid, handled the abuse. So I would say this one is a pass. Pretty proud of that, even though it's ugly. <laughs>